They'd probably say, that Jasmine really likes Beyonce. So I was actually engaged to be married and I was in a relationship where I would never have to work again. Um, but I felt that when I was in that relationship, I wasn't living my true purpose and I wasn't becoming the woman that I really wanted to be. I felt like if I went into that relationship, part of my destiny wasn't going to be fulfilled. So um, I ended my engagement and I sort of started my life over. And that led to me meeting my now business partner and creating Cherry Blossom Intimates. But had I stayed in that relationship, I seriously doubt that I would have created this. In creating Cherry Blossom, I feel like I really fulfilled my purpose because I can help a lot of women. <laughs> They'd probably say, that Jasmine really likes Beyonce because I play a lot of Beyonce in the boutique. But I also think they would call me a leader who leads beside them. I hope to be that where I'm the kind of person, I'm not just issuing work, I'm helping alongside of you to get things done, I'm consistently available. And I think they really value that, being able to ping me and ask me questions. Like working alongside of them our first year of being open, literally fitting patients and customers right along with them, teaching them and guiding them every single day, I think really set the tone for our business. So now as we continue to grow, I think that they view me as a leader who isn't above them, but has created a team atmosphere where we can all bond together. And we can bond together while listening to Beyonce. I think that the younger generation should be careful about following the advice of people who <clears throat> act as if they have a lot of time, because we don't have a lot of time to achieve our goals or to make our dreams come true or to help the world. I wanna make sure that we're balancing that idea of self-care and chilling and relaxing with the understanding that this is such a pivotal time for all of us young people to create something and build something that the world has never seen and to implement change. I just want us to know that we can really get things done while we're young, while we're productive, while we're focused. I don't want us to go into like, well, I'm, you know, I'm in self-care for six years and I never, I never really got back to work and did the things I wanted to do. So just don't stop. Just know you can impact the world.